All right, this is basically just an announcement that Informal Task is available and will be free. And what Informal Task is, is, is a tool that I've been working on over the past few months. And it's basically a modern version of Tiny Task that actually works. So for a short little demo, we can afford, click, click, spam, do movement, go into here, type, go out, scroll wheel, right click, drag, either of which Tiny Task has. Now if you go ahead and play it back, we can see that it follows our mouse, replicates every click, every chat, everything perfectly, and it doesn't miss a click. There's a big issue with Tiny Task is you'll go to do your recording, and when you play it back, it actually doesn't record, or sometimes misses some of the things you do, so it's very inconsistent. Then when you go to actually save your file, it can get corrupted or sometimes loading doesn't work. So both of those features work perfectly. No one's had any issues with saving or loading. And when you save a file, it actually looks like this and it'll be a dot text. So you can see exactly what you're downloading. It's not like binary dot record file. And another plus side that this is, is that you can change any of these values to make it so you can just fully customize the recording that you do. Some of the other features that Informal Task offers is if we go into settings, it has a built-in auto clicker, a draw menu, I'll show that in a second, and a webhook URL. Basically what this is, is you can look up how to put in a Discord uh, webhook URL, and every single playback, it sends a screenshot of your screen to a Discord channel that you want it to. And for the draw menu, if we go back, we can see the key button for draw is control G. And this basically just brings up a little menu where you can draw on your screen, and you can still click past whatever you draw over. So what this allows you to do is, let's say the replay button's right here, I can mark that. So then when I go to record, I can just click that area when I'm done, and I would know that's where it is. And then for me personally, one of the things I didn't like about Tiny Tusk is the UI was sometimes hard to use. So I made it a little bit bigger, but if you like the small look of Tiny Tusk, you can hide the middle section. Or if that's still too much, you can go like this, and it'll just be the six buttons, and it works exactly the same. And yeah, that's pretty much it. This tool will be available on my website, informal.com, for completely free. I won't turn paid, and there will still be the paid version, but that's just like if you want to donate or if there's ever new features I add, I'll just post it there first and make sure it works. But besides that, it'll be free and nothing sh should break, but if it does, I'll update it and fix it. And like I just mentioned, when it becomes available, I'll make an announcement and then you just go to informal.com to download it. It'll be somewhere near the top, if not at the bottom. All you have to do is sign in with your Discord to download it. It's just because that's how it links to the premium one. So it's just the same system. But yeah, if you guys have any questions, just let me know. It's pretty much just tiny task if you use it before. Very simple to use. And this does actually have its own Discord since it's not directly Roblox related. Discord.gg slash informal task. All the updates and everything about it will be posted there in the future.